So what's so special about the Colorado River above like Poudre River or any other river? The Colorado River starts up here where we live and it goes all the way down into Mexico or it used to into the Baja of Mexico and empties into the ocean. Along the way that river feeds all the western states. Well, the southwestern states. And a big drinker of that water would of course be California and LA. So thank us very much for our rainfall water. Oh no, we're entering Rocky Mountain National Park. I don't have a parks pass. Gwen, did you bring a parks pass? No, nope, I didn't. Uh, I guess we're turning around. You guys don't get to see the river after all. Actually, nobody cares. There's nobody here to show the pass to. So this little pond right here, some of this water drains into the Colorado River. Here you can see glistening through the grass some of the marsh that goes into the Colorado River. I think we really need to move to Alaska. Can you guys hear that? I have a wind muffle over the mic. You can just really hear that jet here at 10,000 feet. Grr, arg. This is it, we found the plaque. Well, I gotta be honest, I knew the headwaters of the Colorado were up here, but I had seen a video by a gal named Wonder Hussy who skinny dips in famous water places. And she was here. Now she lives in like Arizona or something like that, New Mexico, I don't even know anymore, but she had pointed out that this was the start of the mighty river. And that led me to say, I live here, I should come see it. In the valley below lies a tiny stream called the Colorado River. It has barely begun its travels, but six miles upstream lies the magical point where water begins its downstream journey to the sea, a course of 1,400 miles to the Gulf of California. En route, the stream is joined in succession by the Green, the San Juan, and the Little Colorado River tributaries, and it becomes a mighty river. It drains a portion of seven states in Mexico, some 244,000 square miles in all, and serves as the lifeblood of the Southwest. So somewhere up on that mountain, there's a rock with a little handful of snow still melting into the rock. And that rock is letting this water out drip by drip. And there's a rock next to it doing the same thing. And this good clean water is gonna go all the way to the Gulf of California. I know, it just looks like a crick, right? Creek, crick? Correct me in the comments, please. the mighty Colorado River. Currently, it's a quiet place. It really does just make me want to pee. Like, right here, right, right here. And so, no, no, she won't let me. 
so as mentioned earlier we were at 10,000 feet we're on the continental divide and you saw the Colorado River heading southwest excuse the pause this is the Grand Ditch draining water from the Colorado and it is clearly heading north north and north is Long Draw Reservoir which will then empty east into the Great Plains of Colorado. So isn't that weird? You're at a spot where the water is running one way because it's engineered that way and the natural water is running another. Pretty cool, huh? Thanks for watching. Oh, by the way, give us some gas money. Subscribe, please. You gotta have, in case you don't know, a thousand subscribers before you start making money on YouTube. <laughs>